Hey, a pleasant good morning, everybody. This is just going to be a quick preview to the Flyers and Capitals game. Um, obviously, the biggest keys to this game were keeping the Capitals off the power play, just as it was with the Bruins, excuse me, because, I mean, they're one of the best power plays in hockey, too. They've been doing the same thing for years, and it works. I mean, they literally are the mantra, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Um, Capitals just continuously uh, get it done on the power play, so you definitely don't want to put them on the power play. You want to try to draw them on the PK, which is good, but definitely not the power play level. And you can score uh, if you can get in front of the net on them. They got two young goaltenders in either Vanacek and uh, Sam Sonoff, two of the best young goaltenders. I mean, Vanacek won the Rookie of the Month for a reason. And then uh, Sam Sonoff's really good. He was just stupid going to the meeting and the, the whole meeting violating the protocol. Um, but, I mean, I think they're going to be a set team. It's either us or them finishing in first, and this is really going to be, or the Bruins, us, them, or the Bruins, uh, I should add them too, uh, are going to finish in first. It's going to be a three-way battle to the end, I think, a grueling battle to the end. It's going to be whoever picks up somebody for fix their holes. Whatever team gets the great guy to fix their holes is going to be who gets there. Is that going to be the Bruins probably adding a defenseman just like we need to because they got a pretty darn young defense now? Um, or is that going to be a team like the Capitals getting even stronger because on paper they probably have honestly the more complete, maybe not the deepest forward team, but if you add in their defense with their two great young goaltenders, then their forwards at the top six I would say they might have the most complete um, overall team to actually be able to compete deeper into the playoffs because their defense is solid. And after all, defense wins championships where um, us and the Bs are not as consistent there. So that's why the key there would be to get more um, defense. But please like, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Let's try to get to 120 by the end of next week if we can. Um, have a great. But um, also, everyone, I hope you have a great safe and pleasant day because enjoy the Super Bowl. We got a bunch of great hockey today plus the Super Bowl. So that's a bonus this year with this condensed season. Great to have some more hockey action leading into the Super Bowl. And then the next key to this game is it, Carter Hart's going to be back. So we need to see a great game from Carter Hart, which I don't expect anything less. And he's going to have a very good game against the Capitals, in my opinion. I think he's going to do really, really good. Um, and I think this game is going to be a 5-1 to one win for the Flyers. I honestly think we're going to do really good. Yeah, that surprises everybody. But we're going to do really good against the Caps and come out really strong in this game and make us really happy uh, leading into the Super Bowl. I think Lindblom, who's supposed to be active, is going to have a great game. I think Fairby's going to pot a couple. Maybe he'll get another hat trick. Who knows? We'll see. Maybe he'll have three of the five. But I'm confident that the Flyers are going to bounce back. I think they're going to do great in this afternoon game and show up and show out on national television and get a big win, and it will really make us be more confident. But we do still need to add another defense. I still want Victor Mete. I'm very high on that kid. I think he's a guy that's actually underrated. He's a career either plus 25 or 29. Uh, Either way, he's been pretty consistent. He can get the puck out of the zone. He's not the most like offensive skilled in his zone. He's not going to pot you a bunch of goals and points, but he's consistently good at defense and can get the first pass up the ice and all that hood spot. So he does very well with that. But everyone have a great, safe, and pleasant day. This has been a short, about four-minute preview to the Flyers and Capitals. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, let's bring that anytime, anywhere to the Capitals in D.C. and beat them. you got to be able to be aggressive against this team, and that's exactly what I think the Flyers are going to do today, get that 5-1 to one victory. Have a great, safe, and pleasant day. Enjoy the day, and enjoy the Super Bowl, everybody. Peace out.